Good morning guys, what's up? Welcome back to another vlog or welcome if you're new. Today is Monday and I'm currently parked outside of Eyeglass World. I'm about to go in there and get an eye exam and uh, I don't really feel like my vision's got worse but every single year it gets worse so I'm just pretty much counting on it have gotten worse. I didn't need new glasses, I really just needed an eye exam so that I could renew my contact lens prescription so I could order more contacts. Um, but since I'm in here, I'm probably going to end up getting new glasses. You know, I'm getting a new prescription. I might as well get a fresh pair of glasses with this new prescription. And I'm pretty sure, as I said, even though I don't feel like my vision's changed, like I haven't noticed any issues, every year my vision gets a little worse, it seems like. So, yeah, let's go do this. Okay, I'm back. I just finished my eye exam. It's now 11.30 and I have new contact lenses in. Why am I still wearing this in my car now? Um, but I got new contact lenses and they are a new brand of dailies. You guys know if you've been following me for a while, I had like major issues with contacts last year and I went several months not even being able to wear contacts and now my eyes can only do dailies. Like I can no longer do monthlies, so it's super expensive, um, but they did just come out with this new pair. It's called like Precision. It actually gave me some samples. So this is like the new kind and I am trying these out so I have them in my eyes now and so far they feel fine I've had them in for like maybe 30 minutes but um they feel good and they're actually cheaper than the daily total ones so that's good hoping that these work out for me because I would love to spend less money on contacts I am back home now and I'm about to start my laundry and then pack orders I want to get these out today it's international women's day so I'm doing a sale today where site-wide is 15% off to celebrate women so I'm expecting more orders to come in now that I just like announced that discount so I'm just gonna be packing orders kind of as they come in up until like maybe two or three and then I'll take them to the post office that way I can get most of them out today but first I have to do this entire thing of laundry oh my gosh I've been putting off doing my laundry like my hamper never gets this full oh I have so much to do I just made it back home from dropping off the packages at the post office so really glad that I got all of those done and now I'm about to eat a very late lunch I'm just gonna have this salad that I got from the grocery store earlier this week I haven't had this one it's gourmet caprice with fresh mozzarella like how good does that mozzarella look oh I'm excited and then I also have this blackberry bubbly to go with it so I'm just gonna eat that and then I have some packages to open that came in and then I know I have another order of packages coming in between today and tomorrow from UPS and it's just a bunch of inventory so I really need to get all the inventory off of the floor of my office right now so that I can make room for that. It's crazy that it's already 3.30 and I still have a lot to do. I actually have paperwork I have to do for my taxes and uh, I've been like putting that off but I have to get it done. I got an exciting package in the mail from Casetify and I am very, very excited. I picked out three new cases from them and I actually got a discount code for you guys this time. So, I've been DM'd a lot on Instagram lately, I feel like, asking if I have a code for Caseify, and I haven't, but finally I reached out to them and asked if I could get a code and they gave me one and it's XO Melissa Lucy. And I think it's for 10% off. And if you end up buying like two or three cases, then that's pretty good. You'll save a lot of money. So, let's take a look. I will link the ones that I picked out in the description. I am so excited. You know, I love me some iPhone cases. They always give me a mask, which is awesome. So the first one that I picked out, I can already tell that I am in love with it. It is pink with stars all over it. So pretty. Just appreciate this. 
And then, oops, I have just a regular classic clear case. You can never have enough just of the classic clear. I feel like this is just such a good one. You wanna show off like the color of your phone. And then the last one that I got is this leather case that I already love the color of. It's like, I forget what they call this color on their website, but it's almost like an off gray color sort of, but it's so beautiful, just very natural finish. And it's like a faux leather. So it feels kind of nice, a lot different than the other cases. So those are the ones I picked out. And if you guys want to check out Case Defy, um, I'll link these ones below and you can use my code XO Melissa Lucy to save some money. This is not sponsored, but they did give me a discount code for you guys to use. So there's that. FedEx just came by and brought my room divider that I ordered forever ago. I'm so excited it finally has come in. I purposely bought this to use as kind of like a background for when I'm taking pictures for some money. Hoping that I'm just gonna unfold it and it's gonna be like ready to go. I guess we're gonna find out. Here's what it looks like. I ordered it on Amazon if anyone cares. Took way longer than just like the usual prime shipping, but it was worth it because this is like just a really cool room divider. It's white. It's just going to be perfect for like backgrounds when it comes to stuff for my website. I really like it. I also just got in some new stuff for Sun Bunny. These really cute earring cards. I just love these. And I made them say thank you on the back with the website and the social media. And then I also had these little necklace holders made. So they just kind of are really pretty pink with the logo. And then new keychains coming to somebody. These are so cute. They're circular and they have a little white tassel on them. I love these. I actually have two giant bags full of them. Those are just going to be like the new free gifts with your order. Good morning, guys. It's 7 a.m. right now, and I just got to the gym. It's the next day. Didn't really vlog the rest of yesterday because I was just in work mode. I feel like I worked all the way up until I went to bed, pretty much. And I got a lot done, so it was worth it. But I'm gonna go in here, and after the gym today, I'm actually meeting my friend Katie to get breakfast and go take some pictures together. So I need to make it kind of quick in here. So I'm gonna go in and get started. I'm not gonna vlog my workout today just because I'm trying to hurry up, so. Finish my workout, so proud of myself for going because I did not want to go this morning at all. I really contemplated just making today my day off for the week. So I have to work out four days during the week, and so I'm gonna technically take it today off. But I didn't, and I'm proud of myself. But now I'm heading home and I have to hurry up and shower get ready to go meet Katie for breakfast. Just got out of the shower and I was not planning on having wet hair but my hair was dirty and I have a hair appointment later today to get my extensions moved up and after you get your extensions moved up you can't wash your hair. You can but you shouldn't wash your hair for like 24 to 48 hours and so I wanted to wash it now so that way it's not super dirty after I get my extensions moved up and I have to wait, you know, and if anyone cares, my hair products that I use after I get out of the shower are the Good Behavior Prep Spray. This is a detangler, frizz control, heat protection, and shine spray. And then I also use the Briogeo Farewell Frizz, which I've been using this forever. And it smells really good. I do both. I feel like in combination, they just work really well together. My hair brush out of here it's like stuck in the drawer also I got this new wet brush at Target the other day I don't recommend it I thought like I wanted a bigger paddle brush because you know since I have the extensions and my hair is a little thicker than just by itself and I thought it would help but this thing is like I don't like it it's it's not as gentle as the regular wet brush and it just feels like I'm kind of raking through my hair I don't even know why I'm using it honestly I should just go back to my wet brush but I bought it so I like feel like I have to use it. It is such an absolute disaster in my office so just ignore that but I want to show you guys my outfit. I am wearing the white Olivia top from Sunbunny. I actually wore this in black yesterday and today I'm wearing the white version. It's just like a really cute linen top. I already showed it to you guys. It's so cute and comfortable and even though I try not to keep everything for myself from Sunbunny, I really do. I did keep the white version and the black version of this shirt because it is just so cute, I had no choice. 
and I'm wearing my Goldie jeans. I cannot even remember the name of these ones. I think these are the, maybe the Riley or something like that. And then I'm wearing these white little sandal flip-flop things. Obviously my hair is wet. And then I have this really cute giant chain link necklace on. And then my gold bracelets from Sun Bunny and these little mini gold hoops. I'm at First Watch now with Katie and we just got our breakfast. We actually both got the same thing because we both like their chia seed pudding. Here's what it looks like. Big bowl of chia seed pudding with a bunch of granola and fruit. So yummy. And then this usually comes with almond butter, but we both just decided to get it regular. I didn't realize they were gonna put butter on it, but whatever, I'm gonna eat it anyway. <laughs> and some jelly. And here's Katie. I am back home now and I just got my order in from Thrive Market which is not sponsored by the way. I just really like ordering snacks from them. It's kind of a fun way to try new snacks. And so Chad and I have been using their service for a few months now. I wanna show you guys what we got for this week. So I've got some coconut oil potato chips. These are sea salt and vinegar and they're kettle cooked. So I am so pumped for these. Sounds amazing. And I love things that are cooked with coconut oil. Like it gives a little bit of a coconut flavor and it's very good. And then I also got these, which I am super excited about. So they're basically like dark chocolate Reese cups, but instead of peanut butter, it's mint in the inside, which just sounds so good. So I got a bunch of those. And then I got two of these chocolate bars. This is sea salt. And then this one is just regular dark chocolate. This paleo snack mix. It's just Chipotle barbecue. I honestly just picked this out for Chad. It sounded like something that he would like. This I don't even remember picking out. It might be like a free gift that they threw in here. It's sea salt flavored crunchy corn. Hmm, sounds kind of good. And then of course I got some more of my smart sweets. I honestly just really like these ones in particular, the little Swedish fish. And then oh, another one of these. And then I got some banana munchies. The last time I ordered from Thrive Market, I just got a ton of plantain chips. So I decided to get these this time, which are actual bananas, but it's like garlic and herb flavored, which sounds really strange, but that's honestly why I wanted to give it a try because I thought, you know, this seems like one of those things that would sound weird and it's actually really good. So I decided to try it and I'm gonna sit over here. And then on this side, I got these Annie's Rice Krispies, which I see these at like Target all the time. So they're nothing like specific to Thrive Market, but I just decided to get them because I always want to try them. And so, you know, I was like, I'm going to get them. And then I got some cereal, some little cocoa rice puffs, and of course some pistachios. I used to be a huge pistachio fan and they had this massive bag for like a really good price. Pistachios are pretty expensive and these are just such a good snack. And then last but not least, I got these Coco Loco chewy bars are just like soft baked brownies basically and it just sounded super good. So that's everything I got from Thrive Market. Lots of new and exciting snacks. It's 2.15 now and I am heading to Starbucks and then to my hair appointment. And I'm really hoping she can work with this hair because I, actually it's honestly not that bad. I'm really exaggerating. I was surprised by how it dried, but it's just like a little bit poofy. Um, but I'm not doing anything like to my hair today, just moving up my extensions. So that'll be nice because they've like grown out quite a bit. Anyways, yeah, I'm running through Starbucks first really quick. I tried a mobile order, but on the mobile app it said that they were out of the brown sugar oat milk drink that i've been obsessed with and i don't really think that's true because they also said that at the other starbucks yesterday and then when i went inside they had it so i decided not to mobile order and just run through the drive through and ask them if they have it because they might have it who really knows who am i to tell 
I don't know anything. I just ordered and they do have it. She just said they didn't have the blonde espresso, which I don't care if it's blonde espresso. It would taste fine with the regular espresso. So I was able to get my drink and Tracy didn't text me back if she wanted anything. So I'm just getting her one of those too and hopefully she likes it. I'm back home now and I got some new inventory that just came in so I thought I would open it with you guys but before that I want to show you guys my new thank you cards I am so excited about these because I designed them myself and they are freaking beautiful so it just says thank you for your purchase and then of course I have my logo and social media on the back so I designed these ones just for when I'm in a rush and I don't have time to like write out a whole letter but then I also designed some other ones that haven't come in yet that have space on the back for me to write on for times when I only have a few orders or when I'm able to. I don't always have time to write thank you cards, but I wanna make sure that people know that I'm still so thankful that they chose to purchase with some money, so that's why I created these ones. I won't necessarily be writing on, but it's still just like, you know, a nice thank you card. So, I ordered those. I forget how many I ordered, but here they all are. And then I have two boxes of inventory over here to go through. And then I have one little package here with some really cute earrings that are coming to the store that I'm so excited about you guys because like my gold bracelets, these are really good quality. So I actually switched into this necklace. It's so pretty, it's the Elisa necklace and I just love it so much. Um, but it's more of like, I don't know, it's just like plastic beaded necklace. These aren't like gold filled or anything. It's not like fancy, but I like having a variation of like some good quality jewelry and then some other, you know, things that are just regular like necklaces like this. Um, but I got these earrings in, oh my gosh, they're so cute. They're little bamboo hoops. Here's what they look like just how adorable i'm gonna wear these like every single day i want to put them in right now but i'm gonna wait they're so cute and these are another one that's like really good quality i can't remember if they're 14 or 18 karat gold filled or plated something like that i feel like they're filled because these were expensive but worth it because they're like an everyday earring so you can get it wet go in the pool or the beach and you don't have to worry about tarnishing anyway let's get into these boxes I don't remember what's coming in between today and tomorrow but I have a lot of inventory coming in and I have a lot that's behind the camera that you guys can't see right now that I still have to go through I don't even remember what this is I couldn't tell you oh this is exciting I'm probably gonna shoot these tomorrow so to shoot in the morning these are dresses that are like this really pretty color oh i like the material of this too it's like super stretchy and then it cinches along the side and ties at the bottom just like a kind of like a bodycon but it's not like a mini dress it's actually pretty long and full length love the color i'm just so into my neutral i'm seriously so happy these came in today because i thought all of this wasn't coming in till tomorrow and as i said i'm taking pictures tomorrow so now i can shoot a bunch of this and have it go live this week so next week so this is a really pretty linen shirt like oversized white linen shirt doesn't look very cute but you will see how cute i make it look <laughs> it's just kind of like one of those shirts where like it doesn't look cute right now but once you put it on it's actually really cute because it looked really good on the model i've also been buying extra packs of everything because things have been going out of stock and i've got comments asking like if i'm restocking things and a lot of times it's gone once I go to restock it. So I've been buying extra packs, which means I'm gonna struggle more to figure out where to put this stuff. So please shop. <laughs> but I'm doing this so that way, if you really want something, you have more of a chance that you'll get it in your size. Cause I know a lot of people have told me that like, this stuff sells out in their size and they can't get it. And the small and medium sizes always go first. So I'm trying to order more, I guess. And another really cute linen shirt. This is, Desperately in need of steaming, but this is very cute. Just another like oversized fit button down. This is like three quarter length sleeves and they're like kind of that balloon style. Another very cute shirt. Lots of black, white, just like all neutral. <laughs> so that's all the new inventory that I'm gonna have the pleasure of going through now. Let me know if you guys like seeing the behind the scenes stuff for somebody, I know a lot of people do. Well, it's a little bit later now and I got a ton done. Went through a ton of inventory, also planned out outfits to go shoot tomorrow with Natalia. 
And I'm about to take a nice steaming hot bubble bath and exfoliate and shave and all of that because I'm shooting like beachy style stuff again tomorrow so I want to have a fresh tan so I'm actually going to go get a spray tan but I gotta exfoliate first and I got this new body wash today when I was at Target with Katie and she got the coconut and vanilla one and I got the lilac and white tea and oh my gosh it smells so good and it was only eight bucks and this is like a massive thing full of body wash so I'm excited to use it <laughs> it's little things but I am gonna go ahead and end this here because after this I'm literally just gonna be going and getting my spray tan really quick and then coming home and watching The Bachelor because I didn't watch it last night. And that's pretty much the rest of my night. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you're not already subscribed, be sure to click that subscribe button and I'll see you in my next video.